This feels so weird because I've already been filming all day or pretty much all day and I'm just entering this video, but you are seeing this at the beginning of the video. So welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing you what Alana eats in the day. I too eat the same things, but it's mainly focused on her plate and what I'm serving her. Yesterday I posted an Instagram story sharing what Alana eats in a day and I got a lot of great feedback on that. If you're interested in it, what? If you're interested in seeing what I posted, the stories are saved under a highlight, I believe under food. So you can go down in the description box. I'll have my Instagram and you can follow me because I plan on doing that a lot more often. I also posted an example of her schedule. So I think I'll just post that here so you can kind of see. I plan out her day the night before and that way I know when she drinks her bottle, when she eats, what she's going to eat and when her nap is. So that just helps me um, and I just made it on Canva. So. so this morning we're gonna start with paleo waffles. This is a dairy free option we found since Alana does have a dairy intolerance and you just add water and mix. So then I cut them into strips so it's easy for her to hold and then I'm going to add peanut butter. This one, its only ingredient is peanuts and then just a few bananas sliced up. So we've been trying out this little Ikea table. Sometimes she'll sit in the chair, other times not. Um, we're not like completely Montessori or anything like that but I do want to teach her to be able to sit at her own table, use a fork and not flip over a plate. Clearly it's going well. And you eat the food. There we go. Yummy. Was it good? <laughs> Okay, so now for snack time, I'm just going to use the berry frozen mix from Walmart and then the silk dairy alternative milk. This is pea, almond, and cashew milk and it has a lot of good nutrition. We're actually thinking of switching Alana to this milk whenever she turns one. So I would normally use a coconut milk based yogurt, but we don't have any right now. So I'm just gonna use these two ingredients. Honestly, want to just get her like a silicone cup with a silicone straw. This one's kind of hard. So if she hits the roof of her mouth, I'm sure it hurts. But yeah, we just share our smoothie. Alrighty, so we have grilled chicken, broccoli, and bell peppers this is actually leftovers so nothing too fancy <laughs> and she walked away Ugh. so many dishes the food was that good alana was it that good that you just didn't want to finish it Oh, great. Well, Alana just woke up like not even two minutes ago from her nap <laughs> and she gets a snack. This grape is a little big. She gets a snack. Would you like to sit down? Would you like to sit down? I cut 
cut up a bunch of grapes. Clearly that they're going a little bad. And then I'll give her a teether. We used to just give her a teether, just, you know, if she was whining or she was teething, but I want to be more intentional with the teethers. If they're going to be a snack, have it during snack time. So just something quick and easy. Since earlier she had a full smoothie. Smoothie. So for dinner, we're gonna have chicken and boiled veggies with a side of rice. And typically I would like to do two different proteins within a day. I don't like to do chicken back to back, but that's what we're having for dinner today. <laughs> completely forgot to end the video officially at some point in this day, but you can enjoy the next few clips of some bloopers and I hope you enjoyed the video. So today I'm going to do a what, a di what, what am I going to do? <laughs> what? Child, come at this. <laughs>